A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back. Take my time, just enjoy the ride. I know man passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so in it, so where I can find myself. Oh, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive. Hey guys, welcome back to McMath Outdoors. Today we are here at the big store. It is one of my favorite places to fish in the early spring because it, there's just a lot of big fish and it's a great place to get content for you guys. Um, we actually just celebrated our second year on YouTube. It was very exciting. Um, I just want to thank you guys so much for all of your support throughout these years now officially. Um, yeah, this is, I'm very excited. I have some super exciting things happening this summer um, and I cannot wait to bring you guys along with. I was here yesterday and I was catching some big carp and catfish and stuff. And down here, it's kind of difficult to land those bigger fish by myself. So um, I didn't end up landing and getting any pictures of any of them. I didn't bring my GoPro because I wasn't really anticipating on coming here initially and I didn't charge any of my batteries. So I have it today and I promised to get you guys some footage of the action today. I don't know if I'll be able to land any of them again but I'm changing up a couple things and hopefully that'll help work. Um, but yeah, so without further ado, thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you on the GoPro. There's the first bite of the day. And there we go. Fish on. Little guy. Oh, it's a freaking bullhead. Gross. Oh, well, there's our first fish. Got the skunk out of the way. Little bullhead. Um, we're gonna go get it released real quick and get back to fishing. Got another bite already. Let's see if it's still on. Yeah, it looks like we're swimming downstream. Oh, there we go. This is a little bit of a fish. Oh, catfish maybe? Ooh. Yep, catfish. Ooh. That's a decent one. Alrighty, there we have our second fish of the day. Little channel catfish. This is a, uh, would be a good eater size, but we're not really interested in eating fish today. So we're gonna send her on back. Alrighty, so where I'm fishing today is about straight out in front of us. Uh, earlier in the spring, the water was super low in here and there's a, a, like a little like sandbar that kind of stretches out here about I don't know 10 feet or so um, and I'm fishing just on the left side of that yesterday I, I seem to have a lot of luck there and my theory is that because this stuff kind of brushes up and goes over that hump it's gonna settle down there a little bit because there's not a whole lot of current um, and then my second rod I, there's a big boil right here where I'm assuming there's different currents going in different directions um, so it's, there's a lot of like stirring right there I am just to the right of that um, and kind of closer to shore. Uh, I was catching, I was getting hooked in a lot of big carp yesterday and I wasn't wearing great shoes so I had a really hard time being on the rocks kind of down there. So, uh, got some boots on. So hopefully I won't be sliding and I'll, hopefully my goal is to actually be able to land one of these big fish today. Oh, I was uh, checking to make sure I had my, checking to make sure I had my GoPro settings right. I got hooked in this fish, and this is a big, big fish. What is it? I brought, brought, uh, about to hug my rod in the water. And he has not gone down stream yet, so I'm thinking this is a lot bigger fish. Oh, nice carp. Oh, whoo. Spit the hook. That was a freaking huge carp. Wow. And I, I had to dodge. I dodged the hook about, it came right to me. Wow. Whoa. 
This is a big fish. It's still there. Yep, it's still here. Oh, no, it's not a big fish, I don't think. I was going to weird bump on its nose. But this is our first fish in a while. Um, yeah. I, I have something small. I keep Whoa, that's not small. Oh, catfish. This guy's got sores all over him. I don't really want to touch him. So we're just gonna plop him back. Wow. For as hard as this hit, I thought it was going to be a big fish. Oh, it's it's missing its tail. It's got like just half of it. Oh, nope, it's there. <laughs> Alrighty, see you buddy. Or at least a bigger fish. Here's the tricky part with the current. Oh yeah, there we go. Nice carp. Woo. Don't want to lose them. I actually would like to get this one on shore. My drag is very tight right now. This one didn't fight as hard as they, they have been the last couple days. It's a big fish. And yesterday, this is where I really struggled was getting them past here because his current seems to liven them up a little bit. They're just so slimy. Oh. There we go. Oh. Oh shoot, I got a big fish on down here too. Yeah, this is a really big fish too. Ah, 
trying to be. Oh, this is the little guy. There we go. That guy's going back. Look. Here we have my biggest carp ever. This thing is easily 10 pounds. It's a big freaking fish. It's, that was, it's tricky landing him right here on the rocks and I just had to play the long game and just let him get tired enough. He's got a big fat belly. These fish are vastly underrated. They're very, very hard fighting fish. Um, but I mean, they're slimy and gross, but they're a lot of fun when you hook into them. And we're gonna get, get them released and try to see if we can't catch another fish. It's kind of cool that we gotta catch both of those fish on that double. Um, but we're gonna release them real quick. <laughs> She's ready. It's another fish. I don't know what it is or how big it is yet. It's kind of hard to tell with all the current and stuff. No, we we'll get a peek here. Man, this thing is just sitting down there at the bottom. This could be a better fish. Oof. Oh, catfish! Oh, this is a decent one. I don't know. Maybe you can just come over this ledge. <laughs> Got it. See you, buddy. All right, I got a bite. I don't know what it's going to be. Hopefully not a bullhead again. Ooh, it's in the current. We'll see, what do we got? Ooh, catfish, it's a big one. This might be the biggest one of the day. Biggest catfish, at least. Uh, no, this one's not quite that big. These are some decent catfish I'm getting today. I've never caught more than one or two here at a time before. And definitely not this many sizable ones. There she is. Decent fish. Again, would be another good eater size, but I'm not eating. See you, buddy. Woo. This is going to be a good fish, I think. Dude, this is a, this thing's fast. Oh, it's a little guy. That thing hits so hard. Whoa. These fish just have some really beautiful colors on them. Look how red this one is. Alright, on to the next one. Whoa.